do you work with a group or do you stay solitary? And this can be also overwhelming because a lot of covens require a, a huge commitment. You have to decide that you are part of that coven. You have to decide that you're all in. <laughs> and this can be a huge time requirement. It could be a huge energy requirement. But there's a huge benefit to that as well, because you get to learn from people who hopefully have been actively practicing for a couple of decades, or at least one decade or a few years at least. And they have some experience and knowledge and they're reputable. On the other hand, staying solitary helps you be more flexible. You can zig when you want to, when other people zag type of thing. <laughs> so you can study all the different things all at one time or, you know, oh, hey, you're done with the herbal studies for now. You can jump over to astrology, that sort of thing, which is really nice for the flexibility standpoint and that you get to form your own path without having somebody dictate that for you. But the catalyst to that one is that you have nobody helping direct you. If you're not self motivated, if you're not a self starter, if you're not able to jump in and just do it because you know it needs to be done, then that's probably not the best idea for you. But there is a middle ground. You can be solitary while also working with other groups and other witches. And this is where you can start attending public rituals, attending public meetups, attending conferences and retreats. There's so, so many that are popping up here and there everywhere because we're finally out of that COVID stage. I think people are feeling comfortable again. They're starting to offer weekend retreats, workshops, um, conferences, expos, that sort of thing. So definitely explore those options when you are digging into your craft. Explore all the things that help you feel connected and thriving in your on your path. And if there's limited resources in your direct area where you can't meet with people one on one, there are so many online options, including my community, the Rebel Mystic community. I also offer free workshops, downloads. So go check the links in my bio if you want to learn more. But there are so many options. So many of us offer online options for those of you who have limited resources where you live. 